a second video of the morning from Jerusalem Jane being out and about so I thought why not take you with me as I'm walking a little bit this way is towards the big post office towards uh, Jaffa gate and the old city as you can see the street Jaffa is being blocked off most likely this is because of the parade that's gonna take place on Monday for Purim cafes are open the Sun just came out and things such as you can see these ladies yeah. People are getting dressed up for Purim. So I'm just walking here. If you come by, you can tavern here. You can pray here, the Jewish prayer. Music is playing. Um, people are out and about enjoying it. But as you can see, we are getting ready for Purim. Um, you can see all the way down. It's just all the way down. Um, I actually read somewhere that Jerusalem hasn't had a Purim parade. I think it was since 1967. They used to have one in Tel Aviv that was cancelled uh, because of the whole situation since October 7. People were saying this is not the time to have a parade and be festive. But here in Jerusalem they decided to have one so that's taking place on Monday. So if you are in downtown Jerusalem on Monday, things are gonna be blocked. It's not gonna be easy to move around. Uh, but of course, it will be extremely festive to be here and see. I'm not quite sure when the parade is gonna take place. I will of course find that out. The police are still here, but that's not unusual. They are always here um, protecting us. There's a guy coming here bringing provision. So now we are entering. Uh, I'm close to Science Square. More police are coming out here. It's a drop off. Uh, this, this is called Science Square. Oh, I gotta back up a little bit. So this is called Science Square. Over here is the famous Ben Yehuda shopping street. This is Ben Yehuda, the shopping street where all the tourists come. At the end of Ben Yehuda, it's called Science Square. And that's where the police, police are gonna back up. I'm gonna just wait a little bit. But this is people out and about before Shabbat getting ready. Uh, this is a new cafe, relatively new coming over here. People are enjoying it. The train are coming, the police are going to get into position. So, just a little taste of downtown Jerusalem before we close down for Shabbat. The train is here. The train can't move now, the train is stopped because of a police car. So let's see if we can keep walking. So it's windy. It's windy today. Um, let me just pass all of these police cars. So they're just getting out here. So this is called Science Square and this has been Yehuda, the famous shopping street. Uh, people out and about. And they really made it nice with all of these places where people can sit and flowers and trees. Um, the police are here also. But again, it's not unusual. So we are getting ready to celebrate Purim. The Jewish people are still home in their God-given homeland. Uh, we have many Haymans today. We have a tour group over here. We have many people who want to wipe the Jewish people out of the map. We saw that on October 7. Hamas has a charter that's calling for the annihilation of the Jewish people. If you look up on the roof, you can see the big figures with the festive for Purim. So this is what it looks like. The police are leaving here. Um, so come to Jerusalem on Monday for the big parade. We have police over here. More of them uh, just standing guard, protecting us just to make you feel safe. That's always a good sign. So yeah, as you can see, we are getting ready for Purim on Monday.